Do you ever get a migraine when a storm's rolling in and then all of a sudden your head starts to pound? Well, you're not imagining it. Studies show about 20 to 30% of migraine attacks may be influenced by the weather. Barometric pressure drops, humidity spikes, thunderstorms, even warm winds. All of these can really mess with your brain's pain system. Animal studies have shown that this falling pressure can activate the trigeminal system, you know, the nervous system behind migraine, and can increase CGRP, one of the migraine chemicals we now target with treatments. Even serotonin might play a role. Weather shifts may throw off the brain chemistry the same way hormones do during a menstrual migraine. But here's the kicker. Weather alone usually isn't enough. It's when weather stacks with other triggers like poor sleep, stress, dehydration, that your migraine threshold finally breaks. And we call this the perfect storm model. So what can you do? Track your patterns, download weather-related apps, stay hydrated, keep your meds close by, and talk to your doctor about other preventive and abortive options. Trust me, we have some ideas. Otherwise, follow me for more science-based tips and huge shout out to Miles for Migraine for raising awareness. Let's beat this together.